be getting closer. Gotta get all this out of the way so I can see 100% around. See how I need to get the best part of this. So we're out of here. be the first time. Five sixteenths off. Hopefully this will fit in here. I can get this panel out of the way. Okay, that's out of the way. But try and put five sixteenths back on. Let's see if I can't get. To, getting close to the goodies here. This side wants to come off. Why don't you? Oh. Oh. Okay. This, oh, all nice and blackened up. So you guys can see that. Hopefully you can. 
It's a nice, pretty copper right there. They're all going to be copper, too. I'm not sure how much all this weighs, but it weighs a decent, a decent bit. And I think this is going to be a little hard to... A little hard to cut through this. A socket? No. Yeah, maybe, just maybe. I'll pull this end cap off here. I'm sure you guys don't care about the rest of this is going on. Nah, this is all, it's all just junk. I got a little bit of clean steel here, but the rest of that, I got to get rid of all this fireboard and Take the rest of the panels off, so I'm not going to waste your guys' time with messing with the rest of that. We all know this is what we wanted to see. I really wish these ends were brass. Wow. Well, I think the, the last one I did that had brass ends, I think it was like... I think it was like 20 or 22 pounds of clean yellow brass off of it, which is pretty awesome. Pretty awesome indeed. There's one that's going to be a pain in the butt. Just one. Yeah. See if we can't get this plastic off. See what I'm working with underneath here. deep socket. I don't have one out here with me. There's one on top, one on bottom. That's going to be a bugger. Yeah, I don't know what was hold, holding this piece onto that steel, but it did not want to come off until last second. Nobody got hurt, so that's, that's the main thing. Nobody get hurt. All right. Look at that. Nice piece of plastic. Anybody, anybody want, want the plastic? I don't need it. All right, look at that. It's all, all copper. Now, I don't know. These might be stainless. Should be. Uh, I'm getting a... Getting a look. No, these are gonna go with junk steel. I'm getting a draw on them. See my yard. Even though this is stainless, this is a low grade stainless, and they will not buy it for anything other than steel. It has to be non-magnetic in order for them to buy it as clean. I'm believing this, but this is actually kind of coming out. I'm actually having a really hard time believing that. Normally I cut these, and it takes forever in a day's age. Alright. Move the garbage tray out the way before I have to pick all that up again. You know what? Where is she getting it now? at that. Don't have to cut nothing. Oh, see? Now that copper. Nice copper pipe. Oh, yeah, unfortunately there's a draw on this. Try to check it again. Yeah, I can feel the draw. So, that sucks. It's, this plate's pretty... 10 pounds in itself. Okay, okay, okay. Spin this puppy around. You can't. No. Good old channel locks. I don't want. I don't need a monkey with that. I don't need a monkey with that.
tie it that good. No way I tied it that good. Once you get these broke free, they're actually, they come on really nice. And of course I'm going to save it now and then they're going to stop doing that. I'm actually kind of happy to be getting this done. So I can get this nice copper off of here and get rid of another um, maybe about a partial load of steel got some other stuff I gotta throw up here but not a whole heck of a lot Jumping spider right here. Come on. Go on, critter. There you go. Somewhere else. Don't jump on me. Oh, you sucker. Almost there. We are almost there. Soon, we'll start working on getting the yokes pulled out of those TVs. And I, I bought two of those barrels so that way, after I, after I start pulling the yokes off, I can start putting all the yokes in the drum. And save it for probably. Right to winter time. Let's see here. Look at that, look at that copper fall. See all that copper fall. This is actually a lot harder to do it. Second time around. They just want to fall off of here. Oh, look at that. things are, I don't know, maybe four, four pounds a piece maybe. And the uh, copper price out here by me just jumped up like crazy. I've never seen number two copper at almost four dollars a pound. So hopefully it stays like that. We got this nice pile. There, four pounds a piece. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That'll be through about 36. Hopefully, we get at least 30 pounds. The prices today, that's gonna be a nice chunk of money. So, got that done. Got some steel loaded up. Got some, got some garbage cleaned up. Like I said, I'll, I'll monkey with the rest of this business later you know to get this little piece of aluminum off here that's gonna be breakage a little piece of brass right here take that guy off it's aluminum tubing that'll come off and then I might I might even just put the rest of this up there as, as junk steel so get a fair little bit of wire out of it I mean not a whole heck of a lot but Every little bit counts. My neighbor came over just a couple minutes ago and dropped me off two, two chairs. 
That's always nice. He always brings brings me stuff over and stuff throwing it down. Always brings it over. We'll get the video of this done soon. Still got some Romex here and some good house wire in there. This is a little bit of junk steel minus the screen. I gotta get that up on a truck. Did some Christmas lights, some of the TV wire out, some more of the TV wire out. So I got going on back here. You know, still got got some stuff that's still gotta get taken apart. A couple ceiling fans, a lot of miscellaneous stuff and That'll be about it. So thank you guys for watching. I really hope it was worth the wait. And we'll get some more uh, more videos out to you guys sometime soon. So everyone have a good day. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you would like. I would greatly appreciate it. And we'll see you next time.